Hey, this is JW Swift GP Style. Just wanted to go over a couple things about the Qualcomm and macros and such as that this morning. Uh, give you some of the basic numbers that you're going to use on the Qualcomm, being on the road on your own, off of your mentor's truck. Uh, starting off at the top, we're going to go with a uh, macro number one. It's going to be your arrived at your shipper. As soon as you arrive into your shipper, you're going to uh, push a macro one. Uh, number two is the second macro you're going to do. That's your loaded call. As soon as you're connected to that trailer and done your trailer inspection and everything, you'll do your macro two. Then you're going to plan your trip, of course, and everything get on the road. When you arrive at your final destination, that's going to be a number five. Macro five, arrive at final. Number six is a uh, empty call. After your trailer's emptied or you've completed a drop and hook, you want to enter in a number six. We're going to go over uh, number seven, that's a payroll request. Uh, payroll is not complete usually till Sunday, uh, but most of the time around 7 a.m. Central Time on Friday mornings, you can put in a macro seven and it will tell you how much money you're going to be paid the next week. Uh, number nine, when you get a pre-plan and go over it and make sure you're able to do it, you can enter in a macro nine and uh, accept or deny a pre-plan. But remember, don't deny those pre-plans until you discuss it with your dispatcher. Just don't start. Don't start turning something down just because you don't feel like you're getting enough miles. Uh, number ten, that's your update your daily hours. Uh, your ETAs, PTAs, you have to keep up with how many hours you've used during the week. Very important. If you want to get paid, learn to do the macro 10 daily and do it right. Uh, 12 and 23, those are for directions. Number 12 is mapped to it, and number 23 is directions that have been typed in by Sally May. And, well, just kind of take them in your atlas, and you'll be able to find where you're going. You just got to use your head and think a little bit. Uh, let's see. Uh, number 22, that's a very important one. If you're running late, it uh, gives you a chance to let dispatch know that you're running late and give a reason why you may be late, whether you're in an accident, uh, sitting in line, waiting to get down through traffic, such as that. Uh, number 29, that's a personal advance. You can enter it after Sunday night at midnight for up to $105 in case you need a little money to get you through the week. Uh, let's see. 52, if you have an accident, if you back into somebody or something like that at a truck stop or, or hit a deer, any type of accident, you enter in a 52. That is for an accident. 55 is your breakdown. If you break down on the side of the road or have any kind of trouble with your truck, you're going to enter in a 55. There are a lot more permits, and you can go to your driver training or driver development department, get a list of all the macros that could be used out here. I just gave you a list of the, the easiest ones and the ones that you're going to most use. So that's it from Swift GP Style and Driver JW. We'll catch you next time. Have a good day.